Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Today we'll go over a few jumps. I'll try to give my best two cents on how to do them. Tell me if you would want me to make a part two in the comments down below. And of course, if you haven't yet, be sure to submit your clips. More information in the description down below. As usual, thank you guys for tuning in. Let's not waste time and jump back into the video. So we're gonna start off with this window jump over here towards catwalk. Uh, as you can see on your left, there's a little hand cam, which is a really sketchy setup I have right now with my phone on my microphone stand, but I'll try to make the best out of it. So, and in the middle of the screen, as you can see, you can see the keys I'm pressing at the moment, like VASD and of course the jump key. If you don't have it bound to mouse wheel, I definitely suggest you doing it. But uh, when it comes to window jump towards catwalk, first and foremost, what I would want you to do is understand how to jump here. You have to understand the timing to actually hit this jump. And little did you know with all of these jumps right here, this one over here, this one over here, and this one from there to here, all of them do not require you to duck. So basically, if you time it right, you can understand how to do it. Just you have to start with this jump over here. That's what I usually suggest. You just simply start with this jump over here until you get it when you start to understand how it goes and then we, you can move forward to the other step. So when it comes to the actual jump towards short, it's really simple as well in my opinion. You just have to understand it's all about timing over here. You have to understand the right time when to jump. When you do it multiple times, you will start to understand when to jump in the right time. First and foremost, you would want to go in like a wave form like this. Where you go like this in a wave, you jump into window and you jump towards catwalk. So basically my region where I love to jump, I jump around this area. I jump towards window frame. And then when I'm in the window frame, I usually jump from around here. So simple as that. You can bind like a bind where you get to this position exactly just like I did or you can uh, play the jumps training map. I will leave that in the description down below. So if you want to set the position just like I did, type in console get pause exact. And when you get this code, the string over here, just simply copy it and bind it to I have it on mouse three. I'm going to do it once again quotation mark just in case paste in and quotation mark again and simply enter and uh, now when you move you will get teleported back while pressing perhaps my key mouse 3 when i'm pressing it i'm teleporting back to that position so perhaps if i miss this window jump i can just teleport back and do it once again so as i said before you can just do it in a wave like i do like you start running like this then you jump up and around that area over here you you jump but you have to understand when to jump when you'll do it multiple times first and foremost you would probably want to hit the frame and then you want to continue pushing forward like running forward and jumping at the end you, you have to jump at the end of this line over here to not get your head stuck against this window frame so it's simple as that just put the position in start with this jump over here but first and foremost, if you're if you don't know how to do this jump, then do this jump first. It's a simple forward jump. Simple forward jump. Nothing else needed. So when you get this done at least ten times in a row, you can try to do this jump first, and then you try the full combo with jumping up and then jumping to catwalk. But if you can manage to do so, it's pretty simple. When you're mid-air as well, what you want to do is uh, when you're jumping jump up here and it's simple you simply turn towards the right side simple as that you want to do it smooth just like that don't do it like aggressively it won't help you just simply smoothly jump towards short i'm just missing it multiple times now feels bad feels bad okay there we go yeah just simply turn the mouse a little bit to the right that's about all you have to do that's a simple strafe you have to do so simple as that just if you don't know how to do it yet, just simply set a checkpoint just like I did and simply redo the jump until you understand how to do it. So simple as that. So now on Inferno, uh, the porch jump from this railing over here. Fence has a really great lineup and we're going to use it in this video as well. So simply you find this like invisible dot over here and you pre-aim this edge of this rooftop. So simply what you want to do, you probably want to again 
get position exact and then you copy and paste it we're gonna bind it once again i'm gonna bind it to mouse 3 you can bind it to whatever you want simple as that when you'll press mouse 3 you'll notice that it will spawn your crosshair like head level but you can adjust it it's way way easier than jumping all all the way around once again so with this jump once again what you want to do is simple run forward and jump simple as that you want to adjust yourself a little bit midair towards the left side and once again it's all about timing understanding the right time when to jump so really simple lineup to use if you want to self boost on porch definitely suggest you guys trying it out i don't know if this broken wall jump is an honorable mention but you can just simply do it by running forward and jumping and ducking at the end if you don't have amazing understanding when to jump use duck because it's almost impossible to jump there without a duck or if you really want to you can uh, gather some style points by trying to b hop from this barrel over here just like that so yeah i wanted to show this jump over here from here to here but so the only jump that i would suggest you learning on this too that you can hit consistently is this jump over here what you want to do you want to create an invisible like small line over here where you want to jump it's a simple jump and duck at the same time and you will most likely hit it every time once again like with the previous jumps all you want to do is turn your crosshair a little bit to the left side when you get up here you can challenge if anybody's crossing long if you come over here you can stand on your legs but if you're standing here you get one kill and they perhaps challenge you it's really hard to get off so you're probably one and done here so be aware of that when it comes to these jumps over here like the xbox jump it's all about just simply jumping and ducking at the same time same with this jump over here but i definitely suggest you guys learning them so a quick tip for this overpass jump on long what you want to do is instead of looking in the wall if you don't want to like jump like this with a straight what you can do is you can simply go with this line in the middle of like this bench and this wall over here just like that and just simply run forward and jump and of course duck at the end or duck in the beginning it doesn't matter i know a lot of people tend to like jump like this and they just simply hit this ledge on top or most of the players just simply jump with a strafe or just like i showed you so yeah simple lineup if you want to do jump like this and that will conclude today's video if you guys got any suggestions uh, let me know down below as i said if you want me to make a part two just let me know down below once again, if you haven't posted your submissions, make sure to do so by following the link in the description. As usual, thank you guys a lot for tuning in. It was Cyrix, and I'll see you very soon.